hi morning afternoon evening so this video um is a continuation of an instagram video that i made but as i know not everyone's on instagram not everyone's even on social media so <laughs> hopefully the people that need to see this get to see it and what that video was about it was basically me explaining that you need to take small steps to get to your biggest goal and not only do you need to take small steps but you need to master those small steps and what you're trying to achieve so you want to go and become a doctor you can't just straight away go and work in a gp like if you're not from the uk a gp is um the doctor surgery you need to maybe firstly even figure out what kind of doctor you want to be you need to look into that. You then need to see what studies you need to take. You need to prepare yourself while you're in uni, college, whatever. You may be working in the pound shop. You may be having to work in a chicken shop, but you know what steps you're taking to get to that bigger goal. There's nobody out there. Well, maybe there are, but you have to work and become the best as you can be at the small things so you can achieve the big things and that way as well you can be better at the big things what's the point of you achieving all of your dreams conquering everything that you've wanted to do and then you backslide and you backslide only because you've missed out certain steps and you've missed certain knowledge of what you needed to not only just get to that point but stay at that point as well because it's all well and good we achieve our goals we get what we want but we want to keep those goals and just as human beings we are always going to strive for more that is what you're meant to do sorry if i'm looking around just because i'm on a busy road <laughs> and i get distracted really easily um see even distractions not good i need to be able to stay focused fully focused on you because this is what my goal is at the moment my goal is to give you as much information as possible and to motivate you to take your small steps more seriously and not be worried that you're not right there right now i would prefer you and this is just I only give advice that I give to myself and this is because I am at a stage of my life where I am changing. I want everybody who sees me, who meets me, especially people that have known me, to look at me and be like, something's changed. Something's changed about you. Even when people come to my house, I want them to see a change because I'm changing. I refuse to be where I am right now, this time next year. And you as well, you need to refuse to be where you are now, this time next year. And the way you're going to get to that next level is by mastering the small things you need to so you can be the best at the big thing you want to be. So what's another example? So the example I gave on, gave on Instagram was about food and nutrition. And if you want to lose weight, so you've got this goal of being a size 10, but yet you can't even consistently take packed lunch to work. You can't even consistently go to the gym. You seem not even to be able to consistently stick to the smallest goal that you have, which could be drinking two litres of water a day. So don't bitch and moan that you can't get to that size 10 figure when you're not mastering the small things that you need to even just start the process. Like, I have so little patience. <laughs> like, I've always said, if I had more patience... My life would be a hundred times easier because I just love to rush. I was raised that if you want something done, do it yourself. Just go and get it. And now the older I get and the more I want to achieve and the bigger of a person that I want to be in this world, I'm realising I have to wait. I don't like waiting, but I have to. <laughs> because what's going to happen? Like I said earlier, I'm going to miss out certain steps. So say I've missed out all of this chunk of this middle, jump to here and then drop all the way back down because I have missed out on the information and the knowledge I need to stay up here. So even for someone like me who has very little patience, I'm training myself to focus on knowing and believing that every small seed that I sow for my future is going to take me to the best place ever every small small seeds you sow is as if you're you're adding a step so you know you see those pictures and they have the steps going up to heaven 
well with your steps not going up to heaven but say going up to your your dream future your dream job your dream relationship your dream weight whatever it may be whatever your dream is by sowing those seeds by learning by doing all the small stuff you are building those steps to take you higher up to your heaven and when you get up to your heaven you're not gonna fall okay maybe you will fall because life has a way of showing you that yeah <laughs> it can just kick you off your chair without you even noticing but even if you do fall you'll probably be more prepared for that fall you'll probably have certain what's the like a crash mat ready for when you fall if it's to do with money you'll make sure you have that savings stacked up so when you fall you don't have to be so anxious you know that it's a small problem that doesn't need to be escalated into a massive ma message into a massive issue that is then gonna snowball everything in your life it's just a small problem and it could stay that small problem because you've already got your crash mats ready to catch you for when that fall comes because you've prepared so yeah that's just where i want to take this video and what i want to end it with is just focus on all of your small steps master them perfect them read as much as possible if you don't like reading listen to audio if you don't like listening to audio find places that you can go find places that you can meet other people who you can talk to we have the internet nobody has any excuse not to know what they want to know and sometimes you don't know what you don't know. So until you speak to somebody else and get that extra piece of information and their years of experience and knowledge, you just won't know what you're missing out on. So just for you and for me, because I take my own advice, because everybody, well, not everybody, there's a lot of people out there that are a lot better at talking than they are at taking action. And I... I, for one, always hold myself accountable and take responsibility and take my own advice into my life. So, yeah, I just want us all to just focus on the small things. Stop looking at what other people have achieved. Stop looking at what other people are doing. Stop looking at how many likes they have or, um, I don't know, just stop watching other people and focus on your smarts, yourself and the small goals that you need to achieve never stop dreaming and never stop thinking of your bigger goal but for now master the small things that you can and become the best at them and reward yourself i find it difficult to reward myself because once i've reached one target i just want to move on to the next one but it is really important to just do something where you could say yes i am making progress i'm taking steps like at school we got stickers the teacher would give a stamp in a book like <laughs> even if it's something as small as that like every time you achieve a goal you put a gold sticker on your little sheet of paper or you treat yourself to a bottle of cider i don't know why cider oh no i was talking about cider yesterday <laughs> so um, yeah just find a way to treat yourself and do the smallest things as best as you can and i promise you you achieve all the biggest things that you want it may take time it's taken me time but I'd rather I take my time and end up being the best and the most successful at what I can be than to rush and it only lasts five minutes so yeah that's Sarah signing out I hope this has helped someone and please like share subscribe put this on your Facebook share it on your Instagram send it to your mum your dad your sister whatever you got to do to get it out there because I want to help as much people as possible I can't like right now do a massive charity or there's so many things I'd love to do to help people but this is the one way I'm trying to help people so help me help other people <laughs> have a lovely day and I'll be back again soon with another video bye